Uh, over the last couple of years, everybody knows about the court decision when it comes to Realtor and Trev and the data. Uh, we now know that there's a variety of different avenues you can get data as a client. I want to know your comment, A, how does that change your approach? Two, how does that change the industry now and going forward? And what, if any, strategies are available that you would suggest, given now that this data is a lot more readily available or, you know, like I said, you know, can be mined very easily? Well, um, I, I think that uh, the, the problem here that we have in society, and not just in real estate, but we'll talk about real estate right now, is that not that there's not enough data, that there's actually too much data. And uh, unless someone is a professional who knows how to mine that data and what to look for, where to look for it, um, it can be very daunting. And I, I don't think anyone has the time to really do the proper analysis. I mean, the years of experience that we have, can we cut through the, 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 the details so that we know exactly what to, to tell people in terms of what, what's better and what, what's the better area, what's a better investment, how to do things. So, um, you know, a little bit of knowledge can be dangerous is what I'm trying to say. Uh, it's there for them if they want to dig through it and they want to spend the time to learn what, what, what's good, what's not, neighborhoods, uh, you know, particular properties, legal, you know, issues that could rise from, you know, easements, etc. I mean, there's a lot involved in the process, but the information is there. And, and the problem is, is that with all that information, they're not guided. So what we have an example, you know, when, I, when we're talking to, to our clients is that, you know, we say we're advertising your property everywhere, but the buyer who's going to buy your property may not be looking in your area. Say, so what do you mean? We all want a property that's this big for this much money. We all start off that way, right? When we actually go out and look, we realize with that much money, we're getting a property that's this size. So they're not happy with that. So now, where do you go from there? So our job is to say, well, listen, if you want a property like this for that much money, you might have to go just over here, 10 minutes away. Can I show you that property? They weren't looking there. But now we show them that property. We tell them about the neighborhood, how great it is. They see a property, they love it. They bought a great property instead of settling <coughs> for something or finding something that wasn't there and then they missed out on an opportunity because they didn't have that knowledge. So information is good. Being able to dissect it is the key.